Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the full moon, right? So it's right around the third, but you know the timing is fluid, so this reading is really timeless. Okay, so let's just see what comes up. What kind of message do I have to deliver today? kind of message do I have to deliver today? Three of Pentacles. Now this is about teamwork. It's about working together, um, usually. Somebody is painting a picture of some sort. Uh, this is a masterpiece. Creating a masterpiece. Interesting. Page of Cups. The Page of Cups is a welcome message. It's a message of love. So there's a message that is coming. Some This is support. Somebody that is very loving, very kind. Expressing feelings, very emotional. There's a, going to be a welcome message that is coming. For somebody that is working on their own thing, this person is working on their own thing. They're creating something and a message is coming for this person. Five of Wands. Now the Five of Wands is kind of like this is a this is some sort of competition. There is some sort of competition. A message is coming. They may be, somebody may be weighing the options. There's lots of options here. But they're going to see clearly what the choice is, right? There is lots of options. There is my clarity. There is definitely there's seven of cups. So yes, there's lots of options here. Somebody is weighing their options and they're going to see clearly what they want to do. Right now they're going back and forth, but they're going to see clearly, okay? They're going to become clear of what the choice is. This person, it is about creating something, about who they're going to work with, who's the best fit, who has the most skills, or whatever the case is. So somebody is, is watching by the looks of things. They're observing. They're getting ready to communicate. Um, they're using their intuition. Oh. Two of Cups reversed. Death reversed. And the Chariot reversed. So mm, there's a delay. We have a delay here. This is a delay. The chariot reversed is not moving forward. This holding on is getting old. This is nearly over. It's a near death experience. Unable to master emotions. Lack of discipline. Lack of willpower not moving right now not happening right now no movement this is something coming to a halt coming to a stop there could be a disaster ahead i just have to i just have to tell you because this could be an emotional outburst or something coming to a dead stop the death reversed is a near death experience or it could be you know something happening all of a sudden Definitely something happening all of a sudden. Two of Cups reversed. It could be a separation. An argument even between a couple. There could be an argument. There could be a disagreement. And, and there's going back and forth with this five of, five of Wands. Somebody is going back and forth. And so there's a delay right now. There, this is why there's a delay. There, there could be, if you, in the way I'm seeing it, it's like at a jury, you know. It's almost like a deliberation, you know, going back and forth. And I don't, I don't have the justice card or any of that. You know, what, what, what is the best option here? Now, the chariot reversed is out of control. Um, emotions all over the place. There's scatteredness. And there's a scattered, there's, 
you know, it's interesting because of the seven of cups is right here in reverse. There's options and somebody is unsure. They're unsure of, but they're going to receive clarity soon. Right around the corner, clarity is going to come. Right now, there's a little bit of a delay because it's either going to be, you got to make a choice. Okay, there's, the, there's, there's competition or there's other options. Anyhow, this death card reversed is... This is lack of direction, scattered thoughts. Um, the death card reversed is a delay, an indecision. There's indecision here. There's indecision with which way to go. So there's some sort of indecision. But the page of cups is good news. Okay, good news is coming. This has to do with a partnership. And it may not be a love partnership. It could be a work partnership. Okay? It could be a love partnership. But this is about skills. It's about who's the best one for the job. Uh, the moon. Judgment. Interesting. So there is definitely somebody. It's almost like a trial. It is almost like a trial, which is interesting. Somebody is having a hard time making a judgment call. They're they are stuck. They, they, they're not sure which way to go. Um, moon, moon. They're all, they're all is not as it seems. All is not as it seems. There is there's something below the surface. There's an unclear and difficult path ahead. And we do have the full moon. This is the full moon. This is for the full moon. Okay, so right now there's some sort of uh, confusion. This is confusion. It's like it's very unclear. Um, and that's why there's a delay. There's a delay because it's un there's an unclear choice. Twos are about choices. So somebody is unclear of what choice they want to make. Um, now, judgment reversed is uh, needing advice, not listening, moving on from that bad choice. Somebody has made a bad choice. Now, this is beware. Beware, beware, beware. You know, we have the death reversed and we have the chariot reversed. You need to be careful. Be careful during this full moon. When you get the moon upright, that is a sign to be careful. Okay? Be careful because, you know, something could come to an end. Okay? This is a dead stop and this is a dead. Okay? So something could come to a dead stop. Somebody makes a poor judgment call. This is a poor judgment call. Okay? It is. So somebody makes a poor judgment call, you know, and they get a reality check. You know, there could be some addictions here. The moon is definitely a symbol of addictions. So there could be some addictions that get somebody in trouble. There is some sort of trouble here. This is bad karma. Okay, there's some sort of bad karma here. Death and chariot reverse can, can be a disaster. This could be a disaster ahead. So there and you need so somebody really needs to be careful. I know that it started out really good and maybe the day starts out really good. You know, maybe it starts out good. This is, you know, this could be going out for drinks, you know, and things going bad. Just saying, I'm just being honest with you. Um this 5 of wands is is, you know, some sort of gameplay as well so there could be some games that are being played you know go you know I don't know what it is but there's some sort of game play here tension there's tension conflict I think there's gonna be a conflict you may want to be a be paying attention to your vehicle okay there could be some vehicle problems some car problems coming up that puts you in a predicament so be beware of car problems. Beware of your choices. Beware of false beginnings because your choices, there's consequences. Judgment in reverse or upright is a card of consequ consequences. So there's some sort of consequences for choices. So beware of, con beware of consequences with your choices during this full moon. Okay, because the death card is here. Okay, in the death, you know what death means, whether it's reversed or upright. Okay, this could be the death or the ending of a partnership. Okay, just just got to be honest with you, because this is a two, it's a partnership, it's a two of cups. 
Um, this is a detachment, a separation, um, a divorce, ending of a partnership, losing a friendship, um, something like that. But the Page of Cups is, is news, and it's very emotional, too. The Page of Cups could be tears. It could be tears. Um, this is this is uh being guilty you know somebody that is guilty or, or will be found guilty this is being ashamed this is not answering the higher call okay this is somebody that doesn't listen to any advice maybe they are live in fantasy land you know maybe they they just live in an illusionary world all is not as it seems this is poor health. This is not healthy. It's not. There's there's dishonesty here as well. Somebody may be dishonest with themselves. Anyhow, all is not as it seems. Now, the moon is ruled by the shadow. What you see is not what you get. You better be careful. Somebody needs to be really, really careful with a judgment call that they are making. They may not be seeing the truth. They may not be seeing it clearly. Somebody's not going to be seeing a situation clearly. And this chariot reverses emotions all over the place. There could be a disaster ahead because somebody's making a poor judgment call based on illusion, based on fantasy, or based on something that isn't what it's all it's cracked up to be. This is lack of control and lack of discipline. Somebody may be making a poor choice because they don't have discipline. They don't have the discipline or the determination or the willpower to make the right choice. Seriously. And that could lead to problems. So just beware. Seriously beware. This is like a disguise. The moon is like a disguise. The moon is ruled by the shadow. What you see is not what you get. So this is interesting. Five of Swords. Now that is a battle. That is a battle. Definitely, definitely, definitely struggling. This is walk away. That is walk away. There could be a hostile situation here where we have an individual that is only looking out for number one. This person has no morals. They have no conscience. Okay? This is an individual that doesn't care about anybody but themselves. They may pretend that they do. Okay? They may pretend. So I feel as though we have a hostile situation on our hands here. I, I really do. I mean, that last card is the Five of Swords. That is that is uh, uh, somebody that only cares about themselves. It's like it's like it's a it's like it's a crime of some sort. Um, this is bad bad karma. Um, This person wants to win at all costs. Could be dealing with a Pisces. Could be dealing with a Cancer. Could be dealing with a Scorpio. Pisces. Cancer. Cancer. Scorpio. Scorpio. Pisces. Cancer. Scorpio. So we could be dealing with a, a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. It doesn't have to be, but it, it could be anybody else. But you really need to beware. Beware of your surroundings. Uh, definitely beware of your surroundings, okay? Because I feel like we have somebody here that doesn't have good intentions. And they want to win at all costs. And they may be feeling, you know, guilty or ashamed or disgraced or something like that. And it feels like they're really struggling. There's definitely a struggle here. Um, there's a struggle with reality as well. So, you know, I feel like we have an individual. And this may be a show-off. I mean, the Page of Cups can definitely be a show-off. So we may have a show-off that wants to win. And this is about playing games as well. And one deck is the tug of war. So it is like playing game wants to win and doesn't want to give up. So... This person may um, have some sort of ulterior motive or something like that. Um, 
three of pentacles now that is working together teamwork compromise uh wanting to we definitely have somebody here that is watching somebody work somebody is being watched while they work by the looks of things Um, and, you know, it feels like there could be an accident or something. Somebody tries to make something out to be an accident. I'd be, be careful for your car. Be careful for your car. Somebody may try to make something out to be an accident. Um, or there could be an accident. Now we have a we have a we could have somebody here that is, you know, a bully. We have bully both these cards. Somebody is a bully. They may have come across in the beginning as somebody very emotional and kind and sweet, but in reality they are a bully. This person wants to win at all costs and they they uh it feels like it feels like they have made a decision that is poor judgment. It's definitely poor judgment. This is poor judgment. We have an individual that doesn't listen to any advice. That is dealing with. And they can't master their emotions. This person cannot master their emotions at all. Mm, out of control. It's out of control. So we have somebody here that is losing control. They're losing control of their uh Ability to make the right decision. So it's like insanity. Knight of Pentacles. Two of Swords reversed. Knight of Pentacles is somebody that plans. This is a planner. This is somebody that plans. And is out is looking for a profit of some sort. This person is looking for a profit. To and they may it may have something to do. They may come offering money, but they have some sort of ulterior motive. Just be really, 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 really careful. Be really careful. Um, could be even mind games here. Anyway, this two of swords. This the two of swords reverse is seeing the truth. Lies being exposed, which could cause an emotional outburst. I feel like there's going to be an emotional outburst ahead. I do. I think there's an emotional outburst ahead from somebody that wants to work with somebody that probably prefers to work alone. Look, usually in the Three of Pentacles, there's more than one person. This person works alone. This person prefers to work alone. So there, we could have somebody that is very upset that, you know, this person wants to work alone and they have some sort of ulterior motive. There's been some sort of separation of partnership and they... They, it feels like they want to win at all costs and they'll do whatever it takes. They, they may be feeling disgraced or embarrassed or something. They're upset that they weren't chosen. Anyhow, this two of swords reversed is overwhelming. Somebody is overwhelmed. They're going through some emotional turmoil and it's extreme. They may have some resentment. I think we have somebody here that is resentful. They are resentful and they're planning something. They're planning something. And it's, it's a poor judgment call, definitely. reversed now this is deep sorrow it is but this can also be 
the death holding on is getting old death reverse holding on is getting old it's time to focus on the future we have somebody here that has been wallowing they've been wallowing they've been moping they've been focusing on the past they've been in a deep depression but now perhaps they're they're moving on or they're doing trying something to move on maybe maybe they're planning on accepting cuz this could be accepting and this is this could be accepting as well something is going on here five of cups reverse that is letting go needing to let go this person needs to let go they definitely need to let go There's prolonged grief. There's definitely some prolonged grief here. And there's lack of healing with the judgment reversed. This is this is poor health, ill health. Somebody's health has declined. And their health is declining because they're ignoring the truth. They're ignoring the facts that it's time to move on or whatever. And when you when you fight the universe or when you fight endings, things get worse. And they've been fighting for sure. Somebody has been fighting, 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 fighting. Fighting the truth. Okay. That's funny. Okay. Let's talk about this. This is fighting. Illusion. Truth. Okay. So, so you know, they've been fighting. Fighting, you know, with their fantasy and the truth. So, that's what's caused so this prolonged depression. And depression leads to poor health. So, it's a big problem. We definitely have a big problem here. So, anyhow, um, this has been a constant battle. It has been a constant battle with letting go. With letting the letting go of ego. Because this is a card of ego. So, somebody's ego has been getting in the way of their happiness. And they've been fantasizing about a partnership with a person that doesn't want to work with them. Which is interesting. Anyhow, um, but the Page of Cups is good news. It is typically good news. But this could also be a dreamer, somebody that is love struck. They're obsessed. Okay? This could be somebody that is obsessed. So we may have an individual that is obsessed that makes a poor judgment call and they end up hurting another person. I just got to be honest with you. So I would say that during this full moon you should uh, protect yourself, okay? Protect yourself. Um... Make sure that you are protecting yourself because somebody is not going to be mastering their emotions at all. Okay? And there could be a very, uh, you know, we could have a disaster ahead. We have the devil reverse, the death reverse, and the chariot reverse. If you, all disaster in the reverse. Up ahead. Okay? And you can say, yeah, it's time to take back control. Yeah, it is, but... It is time to take back control. Somebody needs to break free. They need to break free from their shadow self. Okay, they do. They need to break free from their demons. They need to find a way to control their emotions. But right now, their addictions and their obsessions are getting the best of them. And I feel like they are going to react in a way that is not healthy. Okay? So, I mean, I think that they're planning something. I think that they're planning something. Uh, it may even be spur of the moment, though. Uh... They can't let go. I'm thinking of that tug of war card. They just can't let go. So we have, and it's revenge. It's resentment. So I think we have somebody that is holding on to resentment, and they aren't unable to master their emotions. And they make a choice. They make a poor choice. This is a poor choice. And um, your that card is right in the middle. Now, the death card reversed is uh, a disaster, an accident, an incident. It's uh, uh, destruction of some sort. Mm -hmm. 
one more card. Oh, God. The Ace of Wands reverse had something going south, going down. Something's going down. It's going down really, really fast. Somebody's been weighed down. They've been weighed down by their ego. They've been weighed down by uh, holding on to something that is unrealistic. You're going to need to protect yourself. I would suggest that you protect yourself. <laughs> now we got the fool reversed on the bottom. This is impulsive, spur of the moment, foolish, you know, stupid. Somebody does something reckless. They do something stupid. Lack of judgment. Poor judgment. We have somebody here that is going to make a poor judgment call. And they don't care who they hurt. Good luck.